All right, well, we are eyeing up skies here, and it does look like we are off to a quiet start this morning. Pretty pleasant stuff, all things considered. Here's a look at our weather headlines. Uh, shutting down those storm chances, and we're for the middle of August running pretty hot. We're going to have some windy conditions develop over the weekend. Here's a look at future track for our Friday. Now, these are near record highs well into the 90s, and we're back in that 105 range around Roslyn and Carlsbad, enough to trigger heat advisories. Any chance at a shower or thunderstorm this afternoon does look like it will stay west of Albuquerque. Silver City up through Gallup and Grants towards the Four Corners area, though. Expect scattered showers and storms. Dangerous heat again today. This is probably the last heat advisory for a while for Roswell, Carlsbad, southern half of Eddy County, but respect the heat. Take a break this afternoon. Drink lots of water. Try to get into some AC. Uh, thunder showers will wind down in northwest New Mexico overnight. We'll look for 50 and 60 degree low temperatures in most spots. Saturday looking dry around the state. Uh, outdoor friendly, I suppose, but it does look like we will get some windy conditions developing for the afternoon noon and evening, the pesky winds we're talking about. Uh, that 96 will be, I think, three shy of the record. Note, we're still in the triple digits around Roswell and Carlsbad, but no longer that 105 plus heat advisory range. We look ahead towards Sunday and probably another day with all the way dry skies. It will be another windy afternoon. We take a couple degrees of heat out of the forecast statewide down at 96 in Albuquerque, 101 in Roswell. Uh, we've got Carlsbad at 98 degrees. Now this is Albuquerque's seven day forecast and uh, note we've removed today's 10% storm chance and by Sunday we're no longer threatening records, uh, but it does look like it'll still be windy uh, as we head into Monday as well. Uh, monsoon storm chance is making a return Tuesday into Wednesday. Now let's get to your seven day forecasts here for every corner of the state. Northwest New Mexico, your last day with shower and thunderstorm chances highs in the 90s. A little hotter this weekend with the dry skies. Uh, we'll probably have to wait until Wednesday and Thursday of next week for the shower and thunderstorm chances make a return. Here's southwest New Mexico, 92 Silver City, about 100 or so off the mountains. Storm chances favoring the high terrain and there will be this south to north storm motion. So you'd be right on the edge of afternoon storm development in Silver City with the storms moving away. We're dry tomorrow. Sunday looks like the windiest day of the weekend. Uh, we do have rain chances making a return Monday, Tuesday and increasing Wednesday, Thursday. Here's southeast New Mexico. Should be the last day up around 105, but you can see we're going to add four more days to that triple digit total. I think we're at 55 right now, so that'll take us close to 60. Heat easing by the middle of next week. Storm chances return Wednesday, Thursday. Northeast New Mexico, I think, will be dry today. Uh, we've got those highs up around 90 in Las Vegas, 92 in Raton. I will take a little heat out of your weekend forecast, but only a couple few degrees. Uh, we do have some heat easing by the middle of next week when some storm chances make a return. A high terrain shower storm is going to be possible here in north central New Mexico, but I wouldn't expect much. 92 with dry skies in Silver City today. Uh, we eye up your weekend. Going to keep those highs real close to 90 degrees. We do drop into the 80s next week, and we bring in those storm chances by Wednesday and Thursday, it looks like.